So in May, we launched the Grants and Accelerator Program to help us achieve some of our growth goals. This grants program has a million dollars in funding for the next 18 months to fund individuals and teams that have the expertise necessary to conduct in-depth research, build out our tactical infrastructure for new syndicates and distributors, and improve the user experience and then in simplify the integration process. So the grants program is focusing primarily on these following priorities, legal and regulatory, tactical product improvements, improving the user experience, distribution and marketing, and integrations and composability. I'll provide an overview of a few key requests for proposals or the RFPs that we have on the Dow website on the grants page. One of them is the Covered Yields Marketplace. There is available funding for up to $50,000 for this grant. Uh, we're looking for a team to create a marketplace or modify their existing marketplace to allow users to, to deposit into a vault that includes native coverage by default or with cover prominently presented in the user interface through a point of sale integration that can be an add-on in a bundle transaction. This functionality would provide users with a really easy way to purchase protection at the point of deposit, so each deposit is, uh, deposit is covered automatically. We're also looking for um, a team to help us with hackathon incentives. So we're looking for someone to design a hackathon incentives program for us. The available funding for this grant is up to 50,000. Um, we're looking for an individual or small team to create or sponsor hackathons that bring together talented Solidity developers to solve problems, build new features, and find ways to improve the Nexus Mutual protocol. These hackathons should act as a funnel for hiring or partnering on ecosystem projects. Um, another RFP that's pretty high on the priority list is um, an incentive distribution contract for staking pools. Available funding for this is up to 15,000. Um, we're looking for an individual or team to develop a smart contract that gives staking pool managers the ability to add token incentives to their pool. This helps with the cold start problem when somebody launches a new pool and wants to attract capital. These incentives should be distributed to the individual NXM stakers who have allocated capital into a given pool. Uh, the final deliverable should be production-ready code that can be audited and connected to an individual staking pool. Um, this is a relatively uh, simple contract, but something that would be nice for someone to develop that we can bolt on to these existing staking pools. We're also looking for somebody to help us with uh, our broker sales and product package. Funding for this is up to 10000 And we're looking for somebody that has experience creating brokers packages in the past to create a compelling package for uh, brokers are people that want to help us distribute coverage. This can serve as the standard package used to onboard the next 100 brokers over the next several years. Um, some grants that we have that have higher uh, available budgets, so both of these have up to $100,000 available for them. One of them is a DeFi integrated wallet solution. So somebody that can build a solution that would allow wallets, centralized exchanges, and their aggregators to natively integrate Nexus Mutual coverage into their interfaces and allow their users to purchase protection um, through at, at the transaction layer. When they're looking to deposit, um, you would have something that would prompt you directly in a wallet. Uh, the other one is licensed insurance research. So we're looking for um, somebody with legal expertise to conduct research to identify how a third party operating as a syndicate can become licensed and offer insurance without requiring the mutual to move capital off chain or convert capital into fiat. If the outcome of that research indicates that it is impossible for a syndicate to become licensed, then we would expect that report to include uh, the changes that would be required to allow a syndicate to become licensed. So again, these are a selection of the highest priority grants, but we have other RFPs on the grants page as well. We're also looking for grant application ideas that are outside of the existing RFPs we have, just as long as they fit within our current priorities. So if you have an idea, if you would like to build on top of the mutual, or if you have something that fits into our current priorities and you'd like to seek a grant, check out that page on the DAO website.